Orlando Sanchez Mercado, born Orlando Mercado y Sanchez, April 26, 1946, better known as Orly Mercado, is a Filipino politician and radio broadcaster. He was a senator of the Philippines for two terms, 1987 to 1992 and 1992 to 1998, and the head and anchor of the popular radio program Radio Patrol of ABS-CBN from 1969 to 1971 as well as the field reporter for pre-martial law days in the world tonight. Upon Marcos Proclamation No. 1081 in 1972, Orly was charged for subversion under Republic Act 1700 anti-subversion law and was detained in Fort Bonifacio then his release after nine and a half months in detention, he returned to broadcasting and started teaching. Since 1975 Mercado has been the current producer and host of GMA Network. S. Capwiko Mahal Co. I Love My Fellowman, the pioneer television program in public service in the Philippines. In 1998, he was appointed Secretary of National Defense by President Joseph Estrada. On January 19, 2001, the Chief of Staff and all of the Commanding Generals of the Armed Forces of the Philippines, together with the rest of the military establishment, withdrew their support for President Estrada who was then facing impeachment for plunder and corruption. Their appearance before a throng of protesters at the EDSA shrine was the culmination of what was to be known as EDSA People Power II, Second EDSA Revolution, which ousted President Estrada from office. Mercado was reappointed Secretary of Defense by incoming President Gloria Macapagal Arroyo but resigned the post in protest of the designation of a former Chief of Staff as National Security Advisor who was also the subject of Mercado's anti-corruption campaign in the Department of National Defense. In 2008 Gloria Macapagal Arroyo nominated Mercado as Philippine Ambassador to the China People's Republic of China, also accredited to North Korea Democratic People's Republic of Korea and Mongolia, however his nomination was objected to by Senator Jingoy Estrada, son of President Estrada, then a member of the Commission on Appointments. In 2009 he was appointed as the first permanent representative of the Philippines to ASEAN, a newly created ambassadorial post that then did not require commission on appointments approval. He is currently the Secretary General of the Eastern Regional Organization for Public Administration, Europa, an organization of states, groups and individuals in the general area of Asia and the Pacific. He has taught courses in public administration and communication in the University of the Philippines where he obtained all his degrees, Bachelor of Arts in Political Science, Master of Arts in Communication, and Doctor of Philosophy in Political Science. He is also a faculty member at the Ateneo de Manila University School of Government. On June 17, 2013, he returned to radio broadcasting with his program, Orly Mercado, Already. On Radio Cinco 92.3 New SFM. His wife, Dr. Susan Pineda Mercado, former Capua Co Mahal Co Medical Director and highest ranking Filipina in the World Health Organization, WHO, was named Special Envoy for Global Health Initiatives by the Government of the Philippines in 2018. She is the Philippine nominee for WHO Regional Director for the Western Pacific, a post which will be elected in the 69th session of the Regional Committee for the Western Pacific, 8-12 October in Manila, Philippines. Television programs Radio programs Significant contributions as Senator, among the measures he authored are Generics Drug and Medicines Act of 1988, R.A. 6675 An Act Establishing Provincial Centers for Science and Technology, R.A. 6959 Magna Carta for Disabled Persons, R.A. 7277 Consumer Act of the Philippines, R.A. 7,394 An Act Promoting Salt Iodization Nationwide, R.A. 8,172 An Act Promoting Voluntary Blood Donation, Providing for an Adequate Supply of Safe Blood, Regulating Blood Banks, Providing Penalties for Violations Thereof, R.A. 8,180 
Children's Media Act of 1996, RA 8370. Philippine National Police Reform Act, RA 8851. As Secretary, Minister of Department of National Defense, he instituted a reorganization program in the Department of National Defense to assert civilian supremacy over the military initiated reforms in the Retirement and Separation Benefit Systems RSBS, the Pension Fund of the Soldiers instituted a computerization program for the Philippine Veterans Affairs Office PVAO. Pioneered the use of electronic technology for procurement of equipment and supplies of the armed forces of the Philippines as the Philippines' first permanent representative to the Association of Southeast Asian Nations ASEAN. He led efforts in the Committee of Permanent Representatives CPR, to introduce transparency and accountability in the ASEAN Secretariat by way of extensive budget hearings. Initiated ASEAN's Strategic Communication Plan, which could create a level of awareness and understanding about the regional organization as an imperative in the effort to create an ASEAN community by 2015. References